All right, everybody. So this will be a little bit of a preventative maintenance, uh, preventative catastrophic failure of the cam shells. So what we're trying to do here, we're gonna replace the uh, cam seals from metal cam seal to a uh, composite, almost a plastic cam seal. What that'll do is increase the longevity of the life of these cam ledges. See how these have a little line on them. They're not bad. Can't really feel feel the crack at all. Just still feels smooth. What'll happen is over time, these metal cam seals will wear right into the cam caps. So these metal seals can be replaced with a composite seal. this this will help increase the longevity of the cam caps it'll keep you from getting venous codes cam retard codes and uh, keep your engine running strong for long to get the uh, metal cam seal out. You need a little pick tool. Something like this. That's about it. You can squeeze. Kind of separate the two joints. You squeeze it a little bit. Get in there. It unlocks. Then you just pull on both sides and walk it right over the ledge. You do the same thing with this one. Give it a little squeeze. Get under it. Pop it right up. Two fingers. Oops. Then your metal cam seals are removed. Now going to install the ones. You're gonna wanna dip them in oil. Get them nice and oily. Lubricated. You don't wanna get this nice and oily. This one looks normally. Walk it right on all along the sides. And make sure it doesn't roll. Make sure it's smooth right. Good to go. Do your next one the same way. Walk it down on the 
on them. Pop it right in place. And there you have it, your new composite seals, both installed onto your camshaft. This can help help the life of your cam shells. Help from having to take apart your engine again to fix it. When you're doing this job, make sure you get new cam bolts as well. They're torque to your yield bolts. So you should replace them every time. So we can take our new bolt. Put it on the package. Take our old bolt. Throw it in the garbage. Drop our new bolt in. I want to make sure we get this. Same thing for the other one. Get the uh, get them all looped up, as along with some of the other head components, before we go to time the engine. Now uh, we'll be ready to throw this bad boy back together. All right, you guys. Hope uh, you were able to pick something up from this, and uh, have a great night.